because this project is a little edgy, a little bit of uh, harsh truth in it, and uh, it's coming from a different angle that people may have seen me uh, come from. But um, it's just a, a well-written piece. It's something that, you know, I'm proud of my performance, and I'm going to be even prouder to see that I'm a part of something that's going to be monumental like this. And something that's coming straight out of the South like that, coming out of Mississippi, and, and coming from somebody as a first-time movie maker to have something at this level. When I tell you the, the professionalism and the, the production value and things like that, they are not that of a first-time film maker. I mean, they are they were top-notch uh, production company that, that, that was brought in to uh, work there and also some pieces from Mississippi locally. So it wasn't like he was just outsourcing all of the jobs. He actually had people there in Mississippi. Some of the uh, featured uh, locations are right there in Mississippi. Uh, he's basically going to be able to open the floodgates of a lot of opportunities for Mississippians to uh, uh, get into this game they called entertainment business. So you're on the brink of something very, very great. I think Soul Damage is going to be the catalyst to really spark a lot of indie movies there and bringing in the big boys as well. Because I think Maximus is starting as an indie right now, but he'll be one of the big boys and one of the founders of the movie industry in, in Mississippi on a large scale.